hello everybody welcome to the demo of cluster eventing so eventing for cluster is basically about providing notification when cluster uh, cluster state changes like for example node addition or volume creation or any new entry in the cluster so this eventing feature will provide the notification almost close to real time so and also to provide alerts and uh, if something goes bad in the cluster so you immediately notify the uh, registered uh, eventing clients so this announcement is not at available for the general use but uh, so i submitted patch to upstream so it will be available soon in the upstream master release so okay let me start the demo so i have two vms in the left side fvm1 and fvm2 and the other window is my laptop window so there i will be running events client so which will listen to the events emitted by those two clients those two uh, machines so uh, i'll start from fvm1 and uh, peer probe other vm to make cluster of two nodes and create a volume out of it and i'll show you how eventing works so i installed uh, cluster with the uh, eventing patch in both the vm now i'll start the uh, cluster is running in both the machines so i'll start the eventing in the fvm1 cluster eventing start so it will show the status in the local host currently be, it, because it's not peer probed to any other nodes so that so it's showing only status from the local host start is okay so we can check the status also using the status command so it's say, saying node is up and the event state status also event that's also up so it's showing web hooks none so we have to register the eventing client as a web hook to the to listen to the any of the events so in the my laptop window i start a web server which listens to the all the events emitted by the cluster so basically this is a web server which exposes a rest api to listen to the events which is emitted from the cluster so this this uh, co this example is included in the code itself so it it just shows the table with time stamp event node id and message so no message is available so this is running in port 9000 i'll register this client in the eventing in the first vm i have my laptop name is uh, sonne it is running in 9000 and the url which uh, i used to listen to the cluster events is listen so even i can test it with test command so it's saying web hook okay that means uh, from the node it is able to communicate or it is able to making a make rest call to the my, to my laptop so i'll add the web hook now it started successfully and eventing demons are reloaded so if i check the status it shows the web hooks configured is is this so now i can peer probe to other machines other machine name is fm2 if you see in the my the other terminal the event immediately catch up so the event generated from the node 1 fvm1 so that is pushed to the uh, web hook which is registered so the server web server which is running in my local machine so that is listening to the events so that uh, picked up the event and displaying it so similarly i can create a volume 
so since i added the peer so now i can create a volume with both the nodes it's in the root directory otherwise it will give error so volume is created so the same event is displayed in the terminal also so there is no lag even if it is lag it's negligible so i will start the volume now so that also picked up so if i stop It's also showing in the console. So now I'll show uh, like we saw that uh, the client CLI client uh, which is consuming the event. Similarly, we can have a web server or uh, with UI can show the real time notification. So I have the example in the other window. So I'll run the web server. So currently I am running in one of the node in the peer itself in the FVM1 machine. So once the REST server, REST APIs from Gluster is available, we can move this UI to the other machine. So once I started running, so I can access that uh, access that UI using uh, 5000 port. So it is showing. Uh, the current state of the cluster so we have two hosts which is peer to together and uh, one volume which is in the stopped state which we checked in the previous game so which we stopped the volume here so we'll move this terminal window also to the that side we'll keep it here and this uh, I'll control this is the FVM1 on machine so if you see the cluster eventing status it's showing only one URL I need to add this uh, other web UI also as a eventing client so I'll add as uh, webhook add HTTP FEM1 5000 so uh, this slash listen is the REST API which is implemented in the REST server so I'll, I added this URL it's reloaded now so now if I change any state of the cluster it should show in both the UIs so now I'll start the volume again started it's showing in, in the web UI as well as uh, in the console UI so web UI you will have more freedom to show it beautifully and uh, however it's required so so we can even open a multiple browser windows for example So I opened uh, two windows. So now I change the if I change the state, stop the volume. So it's showing in both the UIs. in both the years I can peer detach so it immediately reflects in the UI as well as in the terminal so currently uh, only few events 
covered so only basic events are covered volume life cycle and uh, peer life cycle so once uh, the current patch gets merged in upstream we will be adding more events to the more events and alerts to the eventing uh, system uh, if you have any questions you can write comments below or you can contact via mail thank you